Hi, you guys. Good morning. I have a special uh, person with me today, and it is my daughter, Sammy. Sammy. Say hi. Hi. So, you guys, we are, um, we've been talking about spring and how things grow, and uh, one of the things that you'll see in the spring are bugs, right? Bugs start to come mm -hmm. out, and we're, we'll learn more about bugs next week, but we are going to talk about one of them today, one insect today. And it is the butterfly. Butterfly. So you and guys caterpillars. and caterpillars because caterpillars turn into butterflies. Turn into butterflies. Isn't that so cool? So later, a little bit later, we are going to pretend to be caterpillars changing into butterflies. So, so you'll need a blanket. You'll need a blanket for that because we're going to get up and move. Maybe. So we are going to read a quick story about butterflies. Butterfly. And then we are going to um, do our our pretend play. Yes. And so here's our story today. Butterfly Garden. So Mrs. Connor held up a package who can guess what is in here, she asked. The first graders did not know. I will give you a hint, said Mrs. Connor. It is something that changes from one thing to another. Is it a monster, asked Egan. Is it a superhero, asked Michael. It is not a monster or a superhero, said Mrs. Connor. She opened the package carefully. Inside there were Five tiny bugs. Caterpillars, yelled the first graders. We are going to learn about butterflies, said Mrs. Connor. Then why are we looking at caterpillars, asked Emma. Caterpillars turn into butterflies, said Hannah. This shows how they do it, said Mrs. Connor. Here's the life cycle of a butterfly. So they start out as eggs and then they become caterpillars and they eat until their, their tummies are full and then they build a chrysalis around them and then after a while they turn it in, into butterflies. At first the butterflies did not move much. Are they asleep? asked Katie. Are they dead? asked Jamie. No, said Mrs. Connor, they are working hard. After a few days, they got bigger and bigger and bigger. After a week, the caterpillars climbed to the top of the jar. They are hanging upside down, said Katie. The next day, Mrs. Connor said, look, they covered themselves up so they can grow wings. Mrs. Connor moved them carefully into the butterfly garden. The first graders waited for 11 more days. They are getting darker, said Egan. On the 12th day, Mrs. Connor said, class, come quickly. The whole class gathered around the butterfly garden. Look, said Nick, something is coming out, said Nia. It is a butterfly, said Egan. The butterflies carefully opened their wings. Why are they so small? asked Emma. They will get bigger very soon, said Mrs. Connor. When the class came back from recess, there were three butterflies in the garden. All their wings were big and beautiful. When they were all big enough, the class let them go. That was even better than a superhero, said Michael. Okay, you guys, go get that blanket and let's get on the floor and pretend. Hi, guys. Okay, I hope you got your blanket ready. So we are, um, I wanted to show you guys this. So butterfly wings are very, very cool because they are symmetrical. And that means that they are the same on both sides, but they're mirror images of each other. So see how this red is the same as this red, and this yellow is the same as this yellow. And you guys get to make one of these this week with your mom and dad. So um, this is Sammy's from when she was at preschool at um, Waterstone. So um, the other thing I wanted to tell you is that I have some real live caterpillars coming to my house next week 
and I got a big um, home for them to live in and we are going to um, follow along their journey as they become butterflies. So I will um, hopefully in our videos next week I can show you guys what the caterpillars look like and then I will keep you updated as they start to change and become butterflies. Isn't that cool? So, okay, grab your blanket. So this is what caterpillars do. Okay. They start out as caterpillars and they've got lots of little legs, right? And so they're on the ground and they like to eat leaves. So I want you to pretend like you're eating a leaf. You can pretend like you're a caterpillar. Pretend like you're a caterpillar. Okay, and then, so you're crawling on the ground with all your legs, and then all of a sudden you get really tired. So, you grab, grab your blanket, and you're going to build a cocoon, a cocoon around yourself, right? So wrap it around yourself, nice and tight. Because they like to be snug as a bug. And you're going to take a little nap. It's going to be a two-week nap. So pretend like you're taking a nap. And then... It's time to get up. It's time to... Okay, it's time to get up. And... What are these? They're wings. They're butterfly wings. And now we can fly. So go fly. Go fly. Go fly away. Get up. Fly. Can you fly? Yes. Okay. All right. I hope you guys are flying around. You guys can fly all over your house and find some flowers to, yeah. to land on. All right, you guys. We'll see you next week, okay?